Greetings and hello and welcome back to EverQuest 2. Welcome back to Greater Fay. And you might notice that we're back at the nursery again. Well, I have good news and I have bad news. Uh, the good news is um, I have clocked up 48 hours on uh, this challenge so far. So that's uh, two days worth. Um, beating my last attempt at doing something like this back in 2017 by a good 12 hours. So um, I'm I'm pretty happy with that. Um, the bad news is, is that in my total and utter haste to try and get ready for this, I fell off Caliphon. So, <laughs> <laughs> to bring up the, the quest counter, I need to increase our death counter to nine. <sighs> okay, so where did we leave off? Um, we did around the nursery, we went to Sapling Spur Outpost, we found out all about the terrible orcs polluting everything, and we went over to uh, the start of the Calathan area and um, uh, helped to revive some of the uh, tree creatures around there. Why are we back in the nursery again, back on this mushroom well? We missed a quest, <laughs> basically. Um, right, uh, I am still mentored to level 5. We may need to change that, but I have been looking at um, the quest for this area and uh, what levels they are, and see, I can survive that, that fall. That's nothing. Um, and there is one or two that we need to pick up. Hello, Clea! How are you doing today? Oh, very nice. Stack beetle. Very good. Counseling DM as well. Nice to see you. Go for an even 10. Um, if I can avoid dying again, that would be fantastic. Dying off um, screen before episode is bad enough. Yeah, I, I kind of I kind of vacated Calathan from the wrong angle, and the floor was a lot further down than what I expected. So, but what we are here for is this, this old bottle, and it's got a piece of paper stuck in it. Those scurvy curs. I found a bottle with a piece of paper in it on the beach in Greater Vadark. The piece of paper turned out to be three short journal entries from a captain who accidentally hired pirates to be his crew. Well, you know, we've all been there. Uh, they, of course, took over his ship and somehow managed to run it to ground here. The journal entries mention a chest. If I can find it, I may be able to claim the treasure. Yeah, that first step is a doozy. Yeah. All deaths must must happen on screen. I was not in any way, shape, or form recording, unfortunately. So, um, so that that one is uh, is lost to uh, to history. Right, uh, day one. There's nothing like being out on the open seas. I'm happier than I've been in months. The sea calls to me like a flower to water, like a bee to honey, like a bird to flight, etc. Day four. The crew are starting to make me nervous. They don't seem to know the stern from the bow. I told Deck Hans Vern to scrub the poop deck and he looked at me like I insulted his ancestors. Not to mention they're all dark elves. I didn't think anything of it at the time. I figured the call of the sea and its and honour amongst uh, sailors was universal. It's possible I was wrong. Day 7 Holy praxis, the air is tainted with the foul smell of mutiny. I can feel my impending doom fast approaching. I don't believe these dark elves are even sailors. I've been hoodwinked, bamboozled, hornswoggled. I can't take them all on by myself, but I can make sure the sea gets them. I've swallowed the key to my chest. They will never survive out on the open ocean without that chest. Right, okay. So we are to go and find the ship wreckage to see if we can find the treasure chest. Uh, 
Well, that looks like a piece of, uh, yeah, ho horn schwaggled. I know. I know. Right, so there's a chest here. Oh, there's a chest here, is this it? A worn chest. I found the chest, but it's locked. Not much of the ship left, is there? Okay, let's take a quick uh, gulp of air. Do I seem to take a while to come to the surface? Right, uh, the, the game is very handily telling me that it's over here. I like these low level areas. And how are we all? Are we enjoying our weekend? Have we had a good weekend? I know Clear's had a good weekend. I did see the stream earlier. And somewhere down here. Oh! Um, yep, that looks like a skeleton. I have found the captain's remains and a key. Okay. So let's go find that uh, chest. Uh, this isn't the only uh, low-level quest. There are there are some the start in Kelethan as well, which I don't think the path that I was taking would have guided me towards. So we're going to try and see how far we get with those, and then we'll pick off more sort of where we left off last time. Uh, right. And what's in the chest? Hey, I opened the chest, but there was no treasure, just oranges, limes, and something else. Okay, uh, uh, yeah, oranges, lemons, and limes. The purpose of the fruit was to prevent scurvy, I supposed. Well, I'm going to have some lemons. Why not? You ate your snacks too quickly. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. You're just going to have to find more snacks. Uh, let's see. So, where did I want to go next? Uh, we need to go to Calathen. And we'll go talk with... A wood elf. We'll set a waypoint. And off we go. Uh, we'll see what shinies we can get on route. So yeah, it's been um, 48 hours, quite a few episodes so far, um, still going. Uh, I, I, I do notice it's looking a lot more busy out there. There seems to be uh, a bit of an uptick in uh, interest in EverQuest at the moment, in EverQuest 2. Can't imagine what that is all about at all. I, you know, I'm, I'm sure it's completely unconnected with the origin <gasps> server that was uh, announced uh, beta starts on the 2nd of May um, <laughs> uh, there will be an origins uh, series at some point I need to go back to my uh, 22 episodes so far and just uh, sort of rubber stamp these with a uh, free to play AB server uh, there will be a mini series for um, the uh, Origin server. Um, it could be a very mini series, or it may be slightly longer. It kind of depends on how much effort the developers have put into making the content on there unique from um, what is currently on live. If there's a lot of unique stuff, great. If there isn't, it could be a short series. Where am I going? I want to go there. I'm pretty sure if I head down this path, there should be a lift into... There it is. There's the acorn lift. Conveniently or inconveniently leaving just as I'm arriving. Come back! Uh, right, so. There we go. I've got all my bits where they're supposed to be. Yeah, it, it was a bit of a scramble. And as, as you can see, if you fall off, Kella, then, it's quite a way down. So, yeah. 
welcome back. I've got to wait for the lift to go up. Dum -de -dum -bit. It's a little bit red in here. Let's look out the, uh, the window as we go up. That is bright. Is there a Gwyn shaped impact crater? Well, there ought to be. There ought to be. That I mean, I must have hit terminal velocity um, falling out from that height. Must have. Right, okay. Oh, God, it is so bright, isn't it? Uh, ah, in here. Right, this is, this is the first test of whether people in Calathan will talk to, uh, to Gwyn with his sort of freeport alignment. Oh, we have a feather. Greetings. Hi, do you have a moment to help me out? Um, actually, I was hoping you could tell me a bit about Calathan. Well, we might as well while we're here. Uh, yes, what would you like to know? Um, how did the Fae come to take over the city? They took over the city? Huh. It wasn't a takeover, not the way orcs would have done. They developed an affinity for us, the Fiadal. We're quite similar in many ways, actually. The Fae helped rebuild Calathan after the War of the Fae, and over time came to look upon it as their home. Oh, what happened to your family? My family's roots have been in Kelethin for many ages. I'm the last one now, so it's important to me to keep on what, what traditions are left. When the will, word of the Tranquil came to Kelethin, most of my friends left, presumably to Kinos. Others wandered away seeking guidance from the gods, and of course, the gods did not respond. Hmm. Oh, there's very few wood elves in Kelethin now. Seems that way, doesn't it? Many of us prefer to keep to ourselves now. Some, like me and uh, Traegar, are fine with, it all, uh, fine with all the newcomers. Maybe it's the catalyst we need to stop living in the past and think of the future. Aren't you afraid of the orcs attacking? I mean, they are literally trying to set the place on fire. Those cowards have seen fit only to besiege Calathan, for they know that our magic is stronger than theirs. Ours is the power of growth which their kind cannot appreciate. When the second Wallosian uh, army rampaged elsewhere, the orcs tried to burn us down, and then settled beneath us in siege. How long did that last? Long enough, unfortunately. Though growth is our ally, it cannot conjure up sustenance for a city that, for that length of time, and many perished defending the lifts. The Fey erected a barrier beneath Calafin to keep the orcs away, but they weren't strong enough to deter them entirely. Oh. The word of the Tranquil is mentioned in the history of the, of the Wood Elves. Oh, okay. Hmm. We'll, we will get to uh, the uh, the history books at some point. Um, not looking forward to it, but yeah. Uh, how did Calafin survive? The Velosian army was defeated by the Green Mist. Our orcs met a different scourge, the Brownies of Lesser Fadark. We're not sure what motivated them, but they came to our aid, breaking the siege, and when they'd won, they simply returned home. I suspect they routed the orcs just because they could. Hmm. Ah, thank you for telling me this. And, uh, well met. what was it that you needed me to help with? Uh, my family has always lived in Calathan, and I'd like to honour their me me memories. The problem I'm having is those darn orcs. They send out their scouts and disrupt me at my prayers. I'd like to have them cleared out so I can finish the ritual to honour my ancestors in peace. Yeah, I'd be glad to help. Clearing the way. Okay. And this isn't part of the traditional path around... Calathan, I can tell because that is definitely not part of the same set of gear as the rest. This is part of the original um, quest for the Calathan. Could you? That's great. Although the Fiadal are not as prominent here as we once were, we still keep to the old ways as much as we can. You have no idea what your help means to me. Hmm? Well, I shall do my best. Right. So, we need to... There are several orcs beneath Caliphant on Orc Hill, and they need to be removed. We need to take about six out. So, uh, we're waiting for the lift. She's down there. Don't 
Don't jump. Do not jump. Look. I'm telling you. Do not jump. Right? You cannot survive that. We have tested this. We have been there. Oh. And we have a new follower. Secrets past. Welcome on board. Hope you're enjoying the stream. No, I am not I am not doing it. I am not making it ten. No. Nine deaths so far is enough. That's weird. It's not actually massively glowy red from this, is it? So it's glowy that side and a bit more kind of mooted on this side. Yeah. Ground floor. Orcs and other unsavory creatures. Ah, yeah. Right, um, let's see. So, we need to kill several orcs beneath Calathan on Orc Hill, which I'm pretty sure is where we went before up here. And you can tell this that this is one of the older quests because it is not marked with the, the blue shading. Yeah, these all count. Nice. Excuse, excuse me, Mr. Orc. Excuse me. Oh, they've got scout if they didn't spot me. There we go. Ooh, we just fell over. Oh dear. Death to all who oppose the Crestbone Orcs! Uh, oh, another one? Hello! Death! Death yeah. to all who oppose the Crestbone Orcs! Mm-hmm. Time to die! This is fantastic, you just keep running to me. Uh, uh, you're not actually worth any loot because you've been fighting that uh, wasp. So I don't think you're going to count, and you didn't. But there's one world count. Okay, we've uh, we've cleared a few out from this area. It should be safe for it to come down and... Uh, Honor our ancestors in the middle of some dead wasps. I'm not quite sure that works, but we have done what has been asked of us. Can we get to the lift? Can we, can we, can we, can we? We got in. We made it. So this is this is a little uh, quest series of its own. So uh, we'll see how far we get with this. Yeah, it... Hmm. I don't know if it's just, it might have been to do with the time of day and where the sun was in the sky, but it's definitely not as bright now, and I haven't changed any settings. Uh, what time is it? Let me have a look. It is currently 8.38 a.m. of Steel Day, Ocean's Fall 12 of the year 41-42. So, it must have been the uh, the morning, the dawn, that made everything so bright. I'm back. Greetings. Have you dealt with those awful orcs? I have. May Chunar bless you. I know these coins aren't much, but they are all I have. No problem, I'm glad to have helped. And, yep, she has another quest. Greetings. Grinian, do you think you could spare time to help me once again? Oh, uh, w were you able to do the ritual of your ancestors? Uh, yes, thank you. I was able to honour them with a short little poem and a bouquet. We used to make a big deal of it in the past, almost like a picnic, despite the danger of the orcs I've always presented. Hmm, I'd like to help you out again. What did you need? I've been working on an anti-venom. Venom? Venom? Venom. I'm pretty sure that's not how you spell anti-venom. 
um, an antidote to the poisonous bite of the underwood crawler. They're a type of centipede that lives beneath Calathan. With so many new faces around, I guess they're sensing fresh blood and are becoming quite a nuisance. Hmm, I'll be glad to help. Uh, level 12. Okay, we might actually need to uh, move quickly to uh, a higher mentoring point. We are still mentored to level 5 at the moment. Thank you so much. All you need to do is bring me back there, thanks. I'll drain the poison out and mix the anti-venom necessary. Okay, I'll get right on that. Uh, and... Yeah, confound under Calathan, east and a bit south from the acorn lift. Which is there again. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, boy. Oh, dear. Oh, da, da, da. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. Oh. oh. Yeah, exactly. Ant anti venom should be O, M at the end, not I, N. Um, um, I'm clinging on to dear life here. If I just crawl around here and then drop down. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was that was ugh. right. Okay. Uh, yeah. Right. So we're looking for east and a bit south, and we're looking for underwood crawlers. Hmm. Let's see if the map knows crawlers, underwood crawlers. Oh, they're actually all in this area over here. Okay. Oh, that is actually showing up on, on the map. Okay. Hmm. Dark embraces. So over this way. Oh, shiny. Uh, someone tells me we want up there. So perhaps we'll go up this way. Uh, I kind of left uh, Greater Fay as the last place to do the new zones in because um, it's an absolute pain to try and get around. It really is. Uh, right. Still looking for some core. We, we find, we're finding orcs for the other quest. Which, uh, yeah, okay. Can I take on level 11 uh, orcs at level 5? Let's find out, shall we? This could be a risk. Yeah. Apparently, the answer to that question is yes. Yeah. Hmm. Oh. Bit of a uh, bit of a posh. Uh, I I have track. Why why am I just standing here and looking uh, confused when I have track? Crawlers. Uh, uh no crawlers up here, game. Uh, we'll check a bit further in. But I am not seeing any callers. Hmm. Let me check the wiki. And the wiki says they're all the way over there. Okay. Okay, all right. Let's go back down. And should be somewhere over here. But no. <gasps>
Okay, uh, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll go over to the Chrono Mages. We shall push ourselves up a little bit. Um, because level five is not going to. Let me just check if there's any any of the low level quests that I need to be keeping an eye out for. Fang of the Wolf. Where's that one? This is where I really should have done my research before uh, before logging in today. But it's just been one of those days. Uh, let's see. Where are you? You're over there. Okay. Oh, this. Okay. Thank you, All Access. Goodbye, All Access. Uh, let's see. Head down this way. Ah, there's a couple of people at the Druid Ring. Hello. Salutations. This is more difficult than I was led to believe. Um, what is? I'm here to regulate the pred predator population. Our hunting has been very poor recently, and so I'm here to help increase their numbers. Mm, by killing the animals that hunt them also? Exactly. However, there are more of them than I thought, and I cannot be out here all week. Perhaps you would like to make some coin and slay some for me. Hmm, perhaps. What does it entail? Firstly, you should slay howlers at the top of the cliff. They are a type of wolf. Okay, howlers, easy. We'll do that. Use that tree north of me to climb to the top of the cliff, the one with the glowing pink flower. Okay. Right, so that's one of the quests. And I wonder if there's going to be the other. Hello. Oh dear, oh dear, this won't do. This won't do at all. How am I supposed to work with this? Um, what, what, what's the matter? I came here in search of a special type of limestone that sparkles like stars in the night sky, but I can't find any. I am a stonecutter of many generations. My goal is to gather the special stone and craft beautiful statues the likes of which no one has ever seen. Hmm. You sound very prideful. Do you need some help? I hate to admit it, but I do indeed need help. Please search around the area for the fabled stones. Perhaps your eyes will be able to see what mine can't. Okay, I'll search for them. Stone like the stars, level 10. Okay. It said they were found previously in Treant Grove. Okay, well, uh, that sounds a good idea. Yeah, so if we hit up a few of these and then probably go back to the Chronomages, bump our level up a little um, and see what we can work out. <laughs> One howler. Oh, we only need uh, three of them apparently. Okay. That should be nice and easy. I shall leave the track on crawlers. And then if we actually find some crawlers... Because I get the impression the crawlers are not where they used to be. I'm just kind of hoping that um, it's not something silly like uh, the crawlers were, were removed from the game, but the quest is still in the game. Which has been known to happen in the past. Uh, right, let's find the way down. The safe way down. You can sort of do that. As long as you just push yourself back onto the wall before you hit the ground. I'm back. Salutations. Did you slay several howlers? Uh, if several is three, then yes, I I did that. I'm yeah, I'm a great hunter. There is more to do though. Bears are also killing the game, and they are stronger. Slay the young brown bear. Bear, sorry. Slay the young brown claw bears too, if you are able. 
And this is not showing it. as a quest well because met. there's no reward for it. Four, eight, six. The Fang of the Wolf. There we go. And we get a new quest, the Claw of the Bear, Knight's Boots. Let me just um. Okay, okay, maybe 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 this is part of the series, maybe not. Uh, excellent, they can be found near Chunar Sapling. Okay, I shall make quick work of them. Right. Let's have a quick look at roughly where we need to be. There's going to be a lot of inputting waypoints today because I, I just get all so easily lost in this zone. What are you booing at? Is, is, is it the lack of jumping to my, my doom? Is that it? <laughs> Here we go. Ah, oh, we need five of these. Ah, oh, right, okay. Like, no, I'm off. No, nope, no, you're not. Let's go hunting for those gems. And one more of those. Congratulations, you're the lucky winner of I Need to Kill Five Bears. Right. Let's head back. Uh, what's that? Over there. Oh yes, I can just about see the book in the distance. If I come up here. You can see how the uh, the quest book is like all the way up in the sky over there. And then as I get closer, it'll come closer to the ground. It's a lovely mechanic. I love it. It does make it possible for you to see at the distance where you need to be. Hello. So you killed the bears of the brown claw variety. Uh, yes, I did. No beast can stand up to me. I mean, you don't have to brag about it, Gwen. Uh, thank you. Hopefully the game population will increase again uh, for good hunting. And may you find good hunting in the future. Fair well, well Matt. Okay. Right, another quest that didn't actually trigger our log. Or oh, did. Oh, no, he did, actually. I didn't think he did. Okay. I just uh, clear that up. Uh, we're supposed to be looking for gems as well, aren't we? Uh, a stone like stars. Hmm. Where does that? So yeah, in the tree ant area. So if we head out up here, we'll go back into the tree ant area that we were in the last episode and uh, see if we can find these stones and get ourselves back on track. Uh, let's see. Ah, could these be the stones? Gathering Starlight Limestone. There we go. If 
match with Growler. Uh, yes, that's going to be uh, something to do with one of the ho Oh, hello, hello. Um. My home now! <laughs> Mine! Okay. 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 Fool's gold coin. Yeah. This is all to do with WrestleMania Day. Uh, which we're not touching. We're not dealing with. We're not. We're not. We're not doing holiday events this year. We're doing those next year. Sometimes the festivals find you. Yes. Yes, that is true. You might not you might not want to find the festival, but sometimes the festival finds you, yes. This is tr oh I thought I cured you guys. Why is that um flashing at me? Start quest a decaying mushroom. Oh This mushroom has decayed quite a bit. This is definitely something Brodo would be interested in seeing. So we take a scraping, a decaying mushroom. There we go, we're just tripping over the quest now. Uh, right, we still need one more limestone. And we'll take you back to that guy of the uh, druid ring at some point when we next go past there. I get a feeling that we're going slightly off uh, track here. There is, however, a shiny. Can I find the shiny before the corrupted... Oh, there's two of them. Maybe they didn't spot me. Maybe. <gasps> Are they pursuing? No, doesn't look like it. Let's try and avoid the spiders. He says, walking into another <gasps> spider. Just want one more limestone. <gasps> ah, there <gasps> we go. There we go. Right. <gasps> Let us go back up to Kelathan. And we'll get ourselves uh, remented to something a little bit higher than level 5. Oh, that's, 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 don't, don't put them right in front of the entrance. Right. There we go. Timeless Chrono Mages. So, um, I, I touched on this in the past, um, and then I've done most of the changing of level off screen. So just to reiterate, the Timeless Chrono Mages are in most cities. Um, usually you go to the Tasker. The Tasker will ask you to go and do some um, dungeon or, or some task that requires being something like level 50, 60, something like that. Um, and then you use the Timeless Chrono Mage to bring yourself down to that level and off you go. I am just using... I kind of need to unment to don't I? I, I am just using the Chrono Mages to change my levels down to fit the content that I'm doing. So we started the nursery last time, so we came all the way down to level 5. Uh, I think we can be looking mainly at level 15-ish things now. We'll just check. So we've got, we've picked up Decay. Okay, yeah, so the level, five, the level 6 and the level 8 quest we've now done. Decaying Mushroom is a 10, everything else is a 10 or higher. So, what we can do is, for 100 status and 5 gold, so it gets a little bit pricey if you change your level too often, uh, we can make ourselves level 15. There we go. And you have to recast your horse. Yeah, we're moving on up. Moving on. No, no, that's not. That's not. That's not saying. And let's not get DMCA'd. Uh, right. So 
We turn to Brodo. Uh, I think he's in this area, isn't he? Yes, he is. He's in front of me. So let's go do that. And then we'll carry on with the quest that we were doing before. Yeah, MP. Of course, of course I remember M people. I'm old. <laughs> oh, the brightness, the brightness. Brodo, we're back. Howdy do. Nice to see you. Welcome back, Gwenian. I hope you've been giving those orcs a wallop. Um, I brought you a sample of a decaying mushroom I found in Tree Ant Grove. Oh, it's proof that the orcs' corruption is spreading. This sample should help us heal the damage they have caused. Thanks to you, I believe we can start the healing before it's too late. Please, take this as a token of our appreciation. A uh, token is accepted. Six silver. Very nice. I'm glad I could help. I don't know if I've been clicking any here, is there? Yeah. It's banker, but... Okay. 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 Right. So, what do we have now? We have no quest to pick up here. We've got this area over here. Uh, und oh, so there's underwood crawlers this area. Okay. So maybe they've been moved over here. There's diseased slitherers. There is a great big massive drop. Yeah. There's crushed bone destroyers. Who are being killed by guards. Is there a... A safe way down here, sort of. Crush bone destroyers. Well, we need those for a quest, apparently. So, uh, let's kill them and then see which quest updates. Uh, wet blanket, apparently. Ext extinguish the flames and slay crush... Blimey, look at this lot. Hi, hi, look, look, look. I know, I know. I've, I've been on Twitch for a few months now, and, you know, I'm up and coming. I know, but please, fans, don't mob. Don't mob. I joke. I completely joke. Chat is not like a horde of orcs. They wears. Uh, right. Okay, let's just get out of the uh, the endless stream of people attacking. Uh, <laughs> I got an oi. <laughs> a fan mob, yes. Yes, pretty much. Um, extinguish the fire. So how do we do that? Uh, let's see. I see a fire. Uh, I see a defeated guard. Oh, I've been to the acorn lift. Okay, that's nice. How do you think that we put out a fire? Uh, there's going to be a pond or something somewhere, surely. Mm. Yes, there's water around there, so... Ooh, underwood crawlers! We found them! Nowhere near where they originally used to be. But we have them. Crossbow and arsonist. Underwood crawlers. What I could do with is a bucket. Hmm. I'm assuming I can't just go and click. No. Oh, oh, there's many fires. Oh, I can deal with those. Right. Okay. I'm looking at the big fire and I'm thinking, oh, how do I put that out? But no, there's uh, there's many ones. And uh, arsonists. Oh, and another underwood crawler. 
Excuse me, Mr. Crawler, would you like to come and join the fun? Okay, and carry on looking. Uh, that seems to be it for this. Is there. Oh, I don't know. Wow, these orcs are just uh, constant. Uh, any other trees are, are ablaze that we can uh, look for fires? Or do I have to wait for those fires to reappear? <laughs> oh no, no, there's a fire starting over there. Okay. No fires, please. Come on, people. Did no, did no one teach you about basic... Uh, basic care of the Far East and you wait till the Forest Ranger sees us. Okay, so uh underwood cores since they are in this area. Uh oh and gather see the star knots. And destroy the crushed bone weapons. Oh, hello. Oh, that's right. Weevils on the evils. See, this is what happens when I read the quest last episode, and then I do the quest the next episode, and I don't remember. Um, I don't remember what the plan was. So we need to find siege weapons, and then we set the weevils on them, and they all basically just eat the things up. Uh, there's another. There we go. More underwood crawlers here, but they're a little bit low level. But you know what? because there seems to be a bit of a lack of them. And I need eight. Uh, do you mind dying, Mr. Orc? Thank you. Uh... Oh, I might regret this. Oh, no, I think I'm okay. Kind of killed a bit of everything there, but there we go. Uh, one more. There we go. Uh, we're slowly clearing out the blue areas. Visit Calathin Outer Stump. Okay. Ah, uh, which is somewhere above us, so. We need to go over here and up. Smokey the Bear is upset. Yes, yeah, Smokey the Bear is very upset. He might be called Smokey, but even he doesn't uh, agree with burning down uh, trees. Uh, we have been there. Okay. Uh, gather, yeah, we still need to gather seed to star nuts and destroy more siege weapons. <laughs> so let's go and find those. Uh, as we're still running around by the looks of it, definitely seen an uptick in uh, people in the zones. This is very nice to see. Yeah, I think we've finally destroyed enough uh, siege weapons. Uh, okay, we're looking for nuts, apparently. I uh, wonder if they show up on here. No, they don't. See the 
just are nuts. Mm. What do they even look like? I'm just not sure about that. Um, hmm. Having to consult the wiki a little bit more than normal. This is definitely a zone that I haven't done anywhere near as often as uh, the others. Ooh, there's this one. It is. Excellent. I'm pretty sure we gathered something that looked like that earlier and it was something else, but... Yeah, okay. Aha. Sounds like the natives are getting restless outside. I've got the uh, the window open today. Hopefully, uh, weird noises won't come through. Um, although I think this microphone's normally pretty good at only picking up me, so we should be okay. I have come outside the area, haven't I? Uh, what I can do, though, is I can nip over here, try and find the safe way down that doesn't involve going and jumping. And we can go and turn these in. Turn in this quest. Hello. Greetings! Were you successful in finding the stone? Um, I was. These stones are heavy though, so I only brought back a few. A few will be enough! Even a small statue carved from this stone will bring my father great pride. Thank you! I wish you would look. Hello! Farewell. No, no, farewell. Not hello. Um. Okay. Let's go ahead back up, try and find a few more of these uh, nuts. In between these nuts known as orcs. Uh, somewhere over this way. Should be in this area. Is it just the nuts in this area that we want now? I think so, isn't it? Uh, yes, it is. <gasps> Come on, game. Don't hide them from me. Where are they? I feel like I'm just running into every uh, orc at the moment. Let's try this way. Here we go. There's some hiding back here. Sometimes, if there's a few people in a zone, what you're looking for can only be found in sort of the corners where people don't look because everybody else has got the easy to find ones. Uh, right, and then that leaves us with... Finding Zephyr Violet hair in the building near the old Calathan Acorn Lift. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, that's over there. Oh, right, that's a turn on, isn't it? We need to visit Granite Hills Acorn Lift. Uh, 
you know what? Let's go and turn in all these various quests, and I'm pretty sure we'll end up in those areas. Anyway, I am just going to ignore any uh, orcs en route. And uh, we'll just make a run for it. Trying to avoid the orcs that were attacking. There we go. Hi everyone, we're back. Uh, Whittier. I no longer see flames threatening Jolina's restaurant. You put out the flames, Gwynion. I did. Those orcs didn't stand a chance. You have the strength of a mighty oak, my friend. Once more, I must thank you for all that you have done. Yeah, I find it rewarding. Ah, and your actions reward all of Fadark. My tree and brethren saw the sun because of you. They can be stubborn and slow to act, but they are very honourable. They know you saved them by applying the healing and elixir to them. Mm, okay, are they willing to help? They have agreed to take up root against the Crushbone threat, yes. Moss Main trusts you and asks that you show our brethren the Crushbone camps so that they know exactly what to prune. Hmm, how should I do that? Take this reed. When you have entered a Crushbone tent, blow the reed and my tree ant brethren will attack the encampment. Hmm, okay, I'll do exactly that. Nice, nice. Alright, uh Oh yes. Have you cooked any food for anybody yet, Amber? I greet you. Oh, welcome on board. Who's this now? We have uh, overclocks. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're enjoying the stream. Oh, you are back, Winian. The spider meat is nearly finished. Were you able to find the cedar star nuts? Uh, yes, I was. They are plentiful. I thank you greatly. Now I know that the defenders will be well fed. I cannot thank you enough. You saved a great many lives today. Ah, do you want to others is my motto. Don't, yeah, yeah, okay, okay Gwen, okay, you don't get too smarmy. Uh, right, foraging under Caliban. Lovely. Well met. Stop saying hello to everybody. It's a weird thing about this zone that you just go around saying, saying hello to everybody all the time. Um, yeah, um, spy, spider meat with uh, nuts doesn't sound like the sort of meal that, meal that I'd want to sit down to, but, you know, horses for courses. And Brodo, we are back. Howdy do! Nice to see ya! The wood weevils lit worked like a charm, didn't they? Yes, they did. I'm glad to hear it. Oh, how I would love to see their faces when you let loose those weevils upon their equipment. It tickles me something good to think of it. Yeah, it was rather fun. I cannot thank you enough for all of the help you've provided in defending Calathan and the Fey Dark from the Orcs. We are all in your debt, Gwynion. Please take this as a small token of our gratitude. Hmm, thank you, Brodo. I like guess more fake crates. Oh, okay. What's that look like? Uh, oh, nice. Uh, any other feathers here? Oh, I need to set up so I can try and see. No, no. I think we're done with this little bit. Uh, oh yes, we still got a ritual of calling as well, haven't we? Uh, which we never worked out where that is. Uh, okay, well uh, we'll worry about that later. Um, looks like we need to go back to Acorn Left for a few things, and we also need to signal tree ants from within Crushbone Tents. 
So let's go and see what we can do about that. Uh, which way is the way out? Down here, isn't it? No, nope, not down that way. This way. Try to find the way out which is safe and not a vertical drop. I know, Spider, I know. So is it these tents up here, or a different tent that I need to go to? Oh, hello, someone's caught me. No, no. Y you've stunned me, but you've given up and ran off. Okay. Do I need to use something for this? Willow reed flute. Ah. Gonna need that open somewhere, aren't I? Where'd it go? Put it in the back some. There it is. There it is. Let's put it on the hot bar. There we go. So does this count? No, I think it's a different area. Um, tree ant tactics. Around Kelathan outer stump. Okay. Okay. I am completely off uh, off plan then. Oh, down there. Okay, well, tell you what, let's go back to Acorn Left and we'll do that little bit and then we'll work our way around uh, that way. He says, running in completely the wrong direction. Over here, over here, over here. Over here. Oh, well. Into water. You're usually safe um, if you're jumping into water. Even if it's like a thimble full of water, as long, as long as you land in the water, you don't seem to take any fall damage. Which is a useful thing to remember. Oh, you debate that. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I think there is one or two places where the water is more sort of picture than depth, and they don't count. But normally, if you jump into like a, a lake or something, you're you're okay. No, I will not. Uh, I will not test you for science. Uh, right. So let's go back in here. I'm back. Found the crawlers. They're nowhere near where you said. Well met. Were you able to obtain the underwood crawler fangs for me? Uh, yes, I have. <laughs> There we go. This is perfect. I'll be able to produce quite a bit of anti-venin venin with these. Once again, all I can offer you is a few coins, but I hope you can put them to good use. I, I never that turn down coin, thanks. And we get... Uh... Oh, okay. Interesting. We get a little bit of uh, chain equipment. Completely unrelated to uh, all the other stuff. Oh, she's got another quest. Well met. I'm glad you stopped to chat. I thought of you immediately when I heard of the problem. I knew you'd be able to help. Um, help what? 
The poor nibblers, their habitat is becoming overrun with all sorts of predators that need your no-nonsense approach. When it's not the prowlers stalking them, it's those pesky river racers scaring them away from the grass they love. We need to get rid of those predators so that the nibbler population can increase. What's a nibbler? Oh, you love her hair decoration. I know. I know. that That is amazing, that is. I mean, is that is, is that something that you can get in game? And if, and if, you, and if not, why not? Uh, I can help. Competition. Okay. Thank you once again. No problem. I know. I mean, uh, I mean, look at this guy. He's he's basically an aura for hair. I mean, look. He's like, look that purple hair. Yeah, I know. I know, mate. I know. Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay, I'm getting up. Um it's kinda of looking at me for sort of why is he just that stood there looking at me? Oh you believe it's a hair option for wood elves. Okay. Mm. Come on, Acorn. So the nibblers are afraid of the river races slithering uh, beneath uh, within Lower Emerald River. When they don't drink, they weaken, making them easy prey for the prowlers. We need to clear out some river races. Okay. Oh, nearly uh, hit the wrong part of the acorn again. Okay, let's see. Where are we going? Uh, I think it might be the river. Mm hmm. I am going to miss these blue uh, markers when we go up to the uh, the higher zones. Yes, I remember this area. We came here before because of uh, the orcs are poisoning the water. River racers. Okay. Need seven of these. Do you want to die already? There you go. Thank you. My bot got a little bit too infused at the moment. And one more. We won't uh, we won't dash back straight away. Let's go and uh, move on to the next little area we should be going to. Um, which is over there. Try to find the Grand Hills acorn left. some uh, fast climbing that is uh, 
There we go, we found the Granite Hills acorn left. Uh, so now we need to go back to Sajaz and report him. As he, he is all the way back up there. Okay, so let's go and sort out tree ant tactics. Should be down here somewhere. Got to go find some orc tents. And then we'll get the, we'll summon the tree ants to come and attack. I think they're up in this area above us to the left. Here we go. So we go into the tent, we go, this is a nice tent. How about I call for some friends? Here they come! Yep, there's not going to be much of a tent in a minute. Yep, and it's gone. Uh, right, let's find another tent. Should be one round here. Let's see if we can sort of sneak these around and then call them in. No, they, they, they pretty much see me, don't they? See, my AoEs can't hurt the tent, but the tree ants certainly can. Here they come! If you ever need a building demolishing, there you go. Nice. And I think there will be another one just over here. Yes. Ah! No. Again, I thought, I thought if I stand here, they won't be able to see me through the wall. Ah, but they, they can't. Oh, oh no, 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 no! I didn't mean to. Uh, I didn't mean to hurt the. Uh, oh, 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 oh! Well, uh, they've destroyed. Um, 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 um. I mean, I, I, when I when I left, they, I'm I'm pretty sure um, the tree amp tree ants were still quite busy destroying the tent and. Uh, uh, um, Note to self, don't use AoEs while their uh, friends are around. Oh. Shh. Don't, I, I, I don't know what you mean, Team Kill. I have no idea what you're talking about. Those tree ants were perfectly fine when I left them. People in my MMO? What's that about? Uh, right, Whittier. Too many witnesses. Um, hmm. Who can I send into chat to clear chat out of any witnesses? Uh, I heard the wind song through the reed, Gwynion. Tell my brother. Tell me my brethren answered it. Uh, they did, and the crushbone camps are no more. That is a weight lifty from my branches. The orcs will always be a burl in my trunk, but you saved the city of Caliphon from them today, and for that I honour you. Thank you. Uh, anything else I can help with? Uh, are you looking to explore more of Fae Dark Grinian? Uh, I am, yes. I thought so. I didn't expect you to plant your roots here for too long. Would you mind taking this blessed acorn to my friend uh, Saren Leafso Leaf's Way? Not at all. She is east of here at Spire Shadow Outpost. 
planted next to Lower Emerald uh, River. I will find her. Right. And Sajas. I knew Chanel would bring you back safely, Gwynion. Tell me, what have you to report? Um, Crushbone, arsonists and destroyers are at many of the locations. Did you see any significant threat? Uh, yes, they're attempting to establish a camp near the city's outer stump. We will have to do something about that. You have served us in our city well, Gwynion. Thank you. Oh, achievement unlocked. Great to fake gumshoe. Ooh. But, but does that mean I've already done 50 quests in the Great Fay? Goodness me. Uh, we aren't we aren't just going to let them threaten colour then, are we? Are you volunteering to help us battle this orcish gorge even further, Gwynion? Uh, I am. I knew you would bloom within this heat, my mighty friend. Go beneath the city and battle the Crushbone Orcs. They threaten our city and while some tactical strikes are being carried out and others devised, we must cause as much disruption and mayhem as we ca uh, can. So this is, I think, going to be a repeatable. Uh, crushing the Crushbones. That isn't what we've just done. Let me just have a quick look. Some repeatables are, you can repeat them, say, three times and then something else happens. And some are just, hey, well, yeah, you can, you can do this three times and then, ah, it's an unlimited repeatable. Right. So let's just do that the once. Okay. Yeah, achievement got indeed. Um, I'm assuming. Let me have a look. Quests. Uh, Echoes of Fade Yes, complete 50 quests of Great Fade Arc. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That was. I mean, I mean, that just took two episodes. Okay. Okay, I'm liking. Uh, we've got nothing further here. So we need to go and slay Crushbone Orcs, presumably come back, be off the quest again, turn it down. Um, and then we need to go and visit some other people. There is a whole additional sort of, we seem to be running out of bits here, but not being kind of pushed onto a new quest area yet. Unless I'm missing something. But we'll head down here and uh, <laughs> oh, oh counseling dm yeah yeah thundering steps oh uh, yeah that was that was not that was not nice was it? oh look i think these orcs will do i'm not actually looking forward to thundering steps myself but it will be a while before i get there. um oh a chest Nice. Let's try and gather what loot we can before everybody else turns up and then let's flee. That was a quick uh, eight orcs. There he is. And I'm back. You do not know the joy it brings me to see you once more. Tell me, have you sown more death and mayhem among the crushbone beneath Calathan? Seems like a very strange thing for a fate to ask. Have you sown uh, death and mayhem? You sure you're not an RSI? That's an evil thing. Uh, yes, I have. Praise the mother of all. Thank you again. Your service and sa uh, sacrifice is greatly appreciated. There we go. Uh, I wish to sow more. No, no, yeah, no. You're welcome. Unlimited repeatable. I could literally just carry on doing that for hours and hours and hours. No end. Right. Uh, so make like a tree. We need to talk to Saren Leafsway. Uh, we need to go back to uh, Zephyr Violet Hair with the wonderful uh, hair in the building near the old colourful lift. Uh, we still have this ritual of... I'm going to have to look that up. 
the ritual of calling. Travel to the top of the Calathan Central Stump, double click the memorial stone and then return. Okay, I don't really like doing quests when they've turned grey, but I am not re-entering down to level 5 for one quest. Uh, and it doesn't seem like there's any combat involved. So, let's do this. He says, immediately finding a way to climb a cliff. Um... Help? Is there a safe way down somewhere? Thank you. Uh, somewhere, somewhere over here. Oh, is it? Is it up? No, is it down here? Or is it up above? I am very confused. Above me, isn't it? Maybe. Call of Memorial Stone for the Fae Calling of Ritual of Calling. Uh, middle number is 92, which implies it's up in the air somewhere. Okay, let's go back to Violet Hair. And, yeah, it's up here, isn't it? But I don't think I... Oh, crumbs. Oh! <laughs> oh, shiny. Spotted grub. Oh, I'm, I am not going to catch that acorn, am I? I am not fast enough to catch that acorn. Wait for me. Oh, I did. Oof, I did as well. Sorry, just taking a quick uh, slug of Dr. Pepper. Keep me going. Not sponsored. If Dr. Pepper would like to sponsor me, that, 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 that never works, does it? Nope, that never works. Uh, Ms. Violet here, we are back. Salutations. How's it going, Grinian? Um, I've gotten rid of those pesky predators. What a relief. The forest would seem so empty without those nibblers, wouldn't it? Yet again, I am in your debt. Uh, that's fine, thanks. Uh, oh no, still another quest. Did it seem to you there were still more predators keeping the nibblers at bay? There were a few of them, yes. Is this a repeatable now? Uh, would you mind helping out the nibblers need the soft grass and with those predators still around they can't get enough to eat? I would be glad to help. It's competition again. Right. Um, let's just check that. Uh, repeatable five times, but then there isn't anything afterwards. Okay. Don't need to do a repeatable quest. Uh, right. We need to go and find somewhere in here, there, this area. Weathered Memorial Stone. And while we're at it, we'll have a look and see what else there is in Calathan. Uh, there's an old dwarf here with a feather, but he's a heritage quest, because it's a purple feather. We will come back to him later. Let's see. Do 
we want to be going that way, we do. Okay. Oh. There is actually... Ah, so that's where Seven Leaf's way is. He's over there. Okay. So let's go and sort this out first. Um, I have lost my way somewhere. Oh, apparently I took a wrong turn and it's down there below us. Okay. Ow. Uh, a weathered memorial stone. So, place the offering maybe. Examine the memorial. We can do that. Uh, place your offering on the memorial. And then leave. And um, you get an all access prompt. Uh, no, thank you. Uh, so now we need to return to Lady Astor. Uh, who is all the way over there? Okay. Ooh, uh, I've seen quest feathers around. Uh, I think this might actually be the crafting area, though. Trade skill tutorial. And this will be. Yeah, adorning and tinkering daily quests. So we don't need those. Are we seeing anything else? You know, I'm pretty sure there used to be some quests around uh, these areas. But nothing's flashing for me. Vague memory of two sisters who. Um, their parent died and they split the business between them and you sort of reconcile them into sort of getting back together and running the business together as a as a pair of sisters um, but yeah EverQuest does this it revises these areas quests are removed which is part of why um, I'm streaming this and more importantly re report, uh, recording it for YouTube because then I have actual documentary evidence that I have hi done there. the quests. Uh, hi there to you. Have you placed the offering at the memorial? Uh, yes, I have. Do you understand or do you have questions? Um, it was a memorial to those who fell during the siege of Culloden. The memorials placed on the remains of a tree burnt during the siege. Many, not just Fae, lost their lives in that time. Many of our spirits were lost in that time, so we honour the returning Fae spirits that much more. We are glad that they return. You see? I see. Okay. May Tuner guide you, Gwynion. You've shown the Fae respect by honouring our ritual. I am pleased to present you with your very own memorial Fae statue. Uh, which looks like that. Hmm. Thank you. So that now leaves us with just find Seven Leaf's way, uh, who will then hopefully... Uh, guide us to what we need to do next. So is he in Calathan? Speak to Seven Leafs Way and the relocated Spire Shadow Outpost. Okay. I have a waypoint, so we'll go and take a look. Uh, oh, it's all the way over. Oh, ah, all the way over there. Okay. It's funny because we we kind of did a lot in this bit, but we never really did much here. But now we're skipping over that entirely and heading over there. Um, I might take a horse. There were horses. I'm sure there were horses. Let's go and have a look. Let's go see if we can find a horse. Hello. 
Hello. Well met. Greetings, traveller. How may I assist you today? I would like to travel, and I would like to travel to... Uh, if we choose the new tuna, new tuna area, and then we can probably jump part way there. Or actually, steam font. I think that would work. I'm pretty sure you can still jump off horses. Guess we'll find out. Should take us across the zone pretty quickly. We don't have to worry about anything attacking. You're immune while you're on a horse. Which is pretty useful. How are we going? Uh, let's see. Yeah. Mm, bit rate is stable. It was jumping all, all over the place a little bit earlier, but now I think we're okay. called a meal for Grum. Why have I not come across that yet? Oh, and I didn't jump off the uh, the horse, did I? Oh no, that that is a removed quest apparently. Okay. Why is that still on the uh, the wiki then? I don't know. Oh, I'm being chased by a kobold. I am scorching. Oh, hello. Hi, guys. Hi. Did you think I've not killed enough skeletons yet? Is that it? Will return. Uh huh. Um, that's where we actually want to be down there in that camp. Uh, let's not take the quick way down. No, we're not taking the quick way, way down. We'll take the slow way down. Uh, we are two quests away from the big number. That is correct. We are on 498. Uh, this might be a good moment to just have a quick look at those figures. So... Uh, according to our own log, we're on 498. That is literally us visually seeing every quest that we've completed. It might be about to become 499. Watch yourself around here, Traveller. There are ravenous beasts around. Uh, that's why Whittier sent me. He wants you to have this blessed acorn. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Grenian, but I think my tree ant friend misled you. What do you mean? Oh, don't be cross with him. He wears his heart on his bark, to be certain. He is always trying to help others and keep watch over us. Right, but why did he send me? You must have helped him a great deal, performed a great service, perhaps. Well, nothing much to stop the orcs from burning down Calathan, you know. That is precisely why he sent you. He thought you could help me. Uh, there we go. Make like a tree. That's 499. Uh, what kind of help do you need? I've not heard from Elar Rough Root or Flit Morning Glory. The scouts are stationed within the trees south of the Combine Spires. They are keeping an eye on an unsettling situation there, close to Steamfront. I need their reports. Okay, I'll get their reports for you. And that's the end of this episode. And no, I'm so kidding. <laughs> okay, we were talking about 500 quests. So we are on 499 on the quest journal up in the this bit up here. There we go. And um, if we go and check the journal, the journal says we're on 489. Now. A chunk of that 10 quest difference is when we did the quest for switching between the cities of Gorowin and 
Darklight, Nariak, and Nariak and Freeport, because they never stay in the journal. Because reasons. So there's a 10 quest difference. If I go to achievements and have a look at quests, Questaholic says we're on 497. So we have three different totals here. All part of the charm of EverQuest. Oh, hello, Ezra. Hello. <laughs> Uh, right, so uh, while we're here, let's talk to the other guys. Uh, Grimply Sniff Whistle. Those snarling, drooling beasts will rue the day, I tell you. Um, what beasts? Rue! What? Oh, the kobolds. A pack of them attacked our last camp without any warning. Luckily, I escaped in one piece. Others were not so fortunate. Don't need to track anymore, do I? Um, are you planning some sort of vengeance? Yes, they will meet their stingy fate at the hands of my cognatic Bixie Bopper. Uh, it doesn't seem to be working. Fiddle bits. A minor detail to be ironed out, I assure you. Why, it will be up and stinging as soon as I get some wing filaments for its aerodynamic lifterators. Gnomes, eh? I can get the wing filaments for you, probably. Does it involve killing something? Perfect! Yes, the Underwood Fade Drakes can be found along the Lower Emerald River. Come back when you have plucked enough wings from them. Okay, I'll be back with the wings. Cognatic Bixie Builder. Hmm. And, uh, one more. Oh, hang on. Let me uh, come down a bit. There we go. Stop craning your neck. What brings you to this corner of the Feydark, my elven uh, sibling? Uh, my search for adventure, my search for rewards, or did you call me sibling? Let's go with that one. I did. I am a child of the nursery, born of spirit bud, but we are both children of Tuner. Uh, yeah, all right. Well, whatever brings you, I bet you came out here of your own choice. I'm supposed to be here investigating the Combine Spires. Specifically, the Order of the Arcane wanted me to study the scorched skeletons that congregate around the spire. Hmm. Yeah, we've already had a run in with those. Uh, why? There was some question as to the cause of the undead, and I have been tasked with solving the mystery as best as I can. If you are interested in helping me, I could use some samples of scorched skeleton bones for a test I have to run. There are plenty of them about in the spire's southeast of you. Yeah, sure, I can get some samples. Okay. Oh, and off she goes. Uh, right, let's start off with these uh, fade rakes, shall we? We'll get yeah. our 500 quests uh, officially according to uh, video evidence. Then we'll get our 500 quests uh, officially according to um, the achievements. And then we'll go and find 500 quests officially according to the journal. Because why celebrate something once when you can celebrate it three times over? Oh, that one went down quick. <coughs> we'll stay on top of here. Don't look at the spiders underneath. There we go. <coughs> Like you on your birthday week. Yeah, well, no, that is true. Oh. That is true. Why celebrate once when you can celebrate multiple times? Uh, there we go. That's five. And we want one. Ooh. Grand Boo the Intimidating. Yeah, a little bit. Fortunately, he's not aggro, so... 
Why do I get the feeling I might be sent to go and kill bears at some point? You know it's going to happen. Uh, we just need one more Fade Drake. You are it. Oh! Yeah! Yeah! There we go. Right, are we ready for this? This is official. Oh, blimey, that sunlight. This is officially 500 quests for the first time. Ack! But then he would have to reconfigure the throttle cog. Um, I have the Fade Drake wings you wanted? What? Oh, right, yes, the wing filaments for the aerodynamic lifterators. That's perfect, Grinian. Glad to hear it. 500 quests, everybody! 500! Only 8,000 to go! Right, now if only I had a toxin for my cogni cognatic Bixi Bopper to inject into the drooling beasts. Ah, that would teach them. Uh, what toxin do you need? Ah, you are such a gift. I suppose the toxin of a huge spider would suffice. Yes, bring me several huge spider venom sacks. Right away. Okay. Uh, if anybody does not like spiders, look away now. And I will let you know when it is safe to look back. Uh, yes, one of the uh, smaller problems, smaller but big problems with uh, EverQuest, depending on who you are, is there is no arachnophobia mode. Um, there isn't a way of patching out the spiders for something else. And they, they are very, very accurate looking spiders. To be certain. Uh, we have now killed six, uh, sorry, uh, three out of six. So uh, continue to look elsewhere for a moment. Uh, that is number four. That is number five. <coughs> and pretty sure there was some. Ah, there's one. <coughs> and that is number six. And I'm just going to duck through here. And it is safe to look. And we're oh, black. It's, it's the um, it's the lighting, isn't it? Let me have a look in settings. Is there something that we can do about that? Because that is that is OTT uh, lighting. Uh, I don't actually need a person, personal torch, actually. Will that help? Yeah, that's better. That's better. I don't quite know why I had, why I had personal torch on. So now it's just the light from the lamp and not that plus my torch. Okay. I am back. Did you bring me the Fang Fandugler uh, Gwenian? Um you sent me after the huge spider venom sacks? Eh? Uh, yes. Yes I did to be used as cognitive cognatic Bixi Bopper toxin. Yes. Very important. Thank you. I'm doing my best. You are doing wonderfully. You are non-stop. Are you sure you don't have a mecha me magic mechanic energy source? Uh, no, I'm more flesh and, flesh and blood. Blast it and bend it. That's what I've been forgetting. I knew it was something. I don't have an energy source for the cognatic Bixie Bopper. What is about this game and everything having three word names? Uh, what do you need? 
Uh, the vine bloom seed pods from within Tuner's Glade would be perfect. They are steeped in magic and super growth energies. Okay, I'll get them for you. Sniff, whistle, superior attacker. Ah, and you get a mini Bixie Bopper, and it looks like this is a repeatable. So I suppose that's so you can get as many of these uh, Bixie Boppers as you uh, as you want. Uh, and we need to go over here, I think. Is that? Is that for skeletons? That's for skeletons. Vine bloom seed pods are in that area. Okay. We do appear to have an extra feather as well. Hello, I did not spot you earlier. Grinian, I was told you would be the one to seek. Uh. You were? I'm very, I mean, I'm very tempted by slander and lies. Or, uh, yeah, you know what? Slander and lies, all of it. I assure you, it is neither. I was sent here on behalf of Princess uh, Xylene in search of the bravest and most skilled. I was told you were the very person. Uh, for the right price, I can be. That pleases me. Princess Xylene can be found at the southwestern end of Tuner's Glade. There's no road to get there, but the entrance is directly west of the Combine Spires. Okay, I'll go talk to her. Princess Xylene of Tuner's Glade. Okay. Interesting. Uh, yes, there is an option to reduce the number of lights. Um... Uh, that's, I, I think that's okay at the moment. It's very bright, but it's very bright because of the lamp. So I've turned off personal torch, and we'll see how that goes for a bit. Um, I'm pretty sure I did have personal torch turned off before, but I think when DirectX 11 went live, a lot of things got tweaked and changed. So... Ooh. Tuner's Glade. Okay. Uh, right. What are we looking for in here? Vine, vine bloom seed pods. Uh, ah. Nope. Nope, that's not it. Hmm, I'm pretty sure there's a lot more things in here as well that, uh... Oh, oh, oh. Caught by a guardian. Ooh, fabric patches. Oh. Uh, let's not just start killing Faye Fly just because of... Hmm. Since I get the impression we're supposed to be helping these, not... Um, not hindering them. What does this thing look like? Uh, oh, ah, but there is a book up there. So I'm presuming that's where the princess is. Can we get there? Oh, hello. Hello. Okay. Uh, do we have to go up this? That looks a bit precarious. No, I don't think so. Must be a way up here. Maybe this? Uh, sort of, maybe. Ah, yes. There we go. <gasps> maybe. Goodness me. Don't make this easy, do they? This is where I find out there's a, a, a there's a way up on the other side or something. Here we go. 
Was there? Was there a way up over there that made it easier? Yes, yes there was. Of course there was. Uh, we are on 501 quests, folks. Are we ready for 500 again? I am Xylene. Welcome to Tunar's Glade. Voices, voices. I am Gwynion. Alexi uh, Una sent me. Good. I am glad you have arrived. Not long ago, one of the Glade Guardians turned on its caretaker. This is... Well, I'm sure I don't need to tell you how concerning this is. Questaholic! Got the achievement. So that's now that's, the, that's our second hitting 500. And then our third one will be when the journal says 500, which will be in about eight quest time. Uh, right. Uh, what can I do to help? Well, we would like to figure out what has caused this corruption. There has been talk of this... This poison being given to the Glade Guardians through the food they ingest. The Glade Shrublings. If you could collect some, it would be helpful. Okay, I shall do exactly that. You can find them all around Tunar's Glade. Cool. Uh, I, I, I don't suppose you could tell me what a seed pod looks like. Eh, she seems to be a bit fixated on something up above us. Okay, we'll leave her to it. <gasps> so let's try this way down. <gasps> oh, actually. Uh, and then <gasps> over... And sort of down this way. Nice! Right, don't kill the nice fae. Oh, is that a seed pod? There, we've got a first seed pod. Need five of those. I'm pretty sure there's several quests that involve coming into this area. We just don't seem to have uh, picked up the others yet. Um... Well, I'm going to have to get past you, unfortunately. <laughs> And that's the game taunting us. Because one of those dropped a fabric patch before, and now they're not. Right. Uh, let's see. Any more? There's one. And one more. Probably not around there. Ah, there we go. Oh, an angered fey fly. Yeah, she picked a fire to buzz. Okay. Uh, and we also need to collect some glade shrubbling samples. Is that what these are? There it is indeed. Let's gather these on the way out and then see if turning in this quest will... Uh, Unlock some of the others. We might need to go up and look at the skeletons first. I don't know. Trying to find the right order of things. And we're back. Did you bring the vine bloom seed pods, Gwynion? Uh, yes, here they are. Excellent. Now I'll slide them into place and zing back bang. We have lift off. Oh, they will rue the day. Rue. I. Yeah, rue. That was amazing. Now just imagine what we could do with a hive of cognatic bixi boppers. Yep. Uh, awesome. If you grab me more vine balloon seed pods, I can send another one after the kobolds. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe no. later. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, I think I'm done with your repeatable quest. Uh, right. Let's go and have a look at these skeletons, shall we? I need to do whatever I need to do to unlock doing more 
quests in that fey area. So uh, we need to come up here and collect scorched bone fragments. Uh, hi, hi everyone. Hi. I am scorching. Well, I hope you are scorching because if you weren't scorching, you'd be a long sort of skeleton. I will return. I will return. Okay. No actual loot by the looks of it, but we are getting updates. Oh, uh, we've got that thing where it's acting like we're still in battle. And going slowly. Okay. The fires of the ether are under my control. There's another. There we go. Back up to our normal speed again. Um, the fires of the ether are under my control. There we go. Oh, shiny. Uh, a jewel beetle, which we've already got. Uh, back in the original uh, days of EverQuest 2, the collections were actually quests. They appear appeared in your quest journal instead of their own separate category. Um, if you picked up uh, too many collections, you could actually fill your journal with uh, collection quests and not have any room left for other quests. Ah, uh, right, so... Have you collected the bone fragments? I have. Great! This makes the next step possible. Hmm, okay. It's like they started finding the voice again. Uh, okay. The scroll has been completed. What scroll? Oh, the, the scroll of Arca Arcanic Disruption. More tests from my superiors. They want to see if their spell truly can cleanse the skeletons. Based on what it did to those bone fragments, however, I don't think there'll be much left once the skeleton has been cleansed. Well, we won't know until we try. Exactly. We still have to test it on actual skeletons. Use the spell imbued within the scroll on the skeletons. The scroll itself will keep track of whatever data my superiors wish to collect. Okay, I'll do it. Uh, use the scroll upon the scorched skeletons. So we are going back. Yeah, it's kind of like... They, they have a, a voice, and then they don't have a voice, and then they have a back voice back, and it's like, oh, what happened to your voice files? You obviously had vo yeah, full voice files at some point. And then one day the you lost them. Of the ether are under my control. <laughs> hmm. Oh, got that book again. How close can I get? I am scorching. Yeah. So I still have to kill them even when I've uh, used the scroll by the looks of it. Oh no, that, I think that one vanished. Maybe. The fires of the ether. I see. I don't fight back. Yeah, no, yeah. Okay, so I don't need to fight them. I just need to. Uh, Scroll them. I am scorching. It just doesn't take effect straight away. Okay. Apparently they're a bit hot, Scorchio. Maybe they'll resurface later. Well, yeah, I can't. Ooh. Ooh. An reanimated Nexus Guyon. You count? I am scorching. Yes. Wow. The fires of the ether are under my control. <laughs> and one more for the road.
Excuse me, Mr. Skeleton. Hi. The fires of the ether are under my control. No, they're not, because you're just disintegrated into the ground. Right, okay. Oh, oh that wasn't a proper drop. Stop your complaining. Hi. Hello there. What did you find, Granny, and were the skeletons cleansed? Um, I'm not sure. They began to glow and then they crumbled. Hmm. If they were cleansed, they would return to the soil. Perhaps that is what has happened. The scroll of arcanic disruption will certainly hold the answer. Thank you for your help. Ah, uh, you're welcome. Oh no, where did they go? I could have sworn. Um, what's wrong? The last time I had them was... Oh no, my papers, all of my notes, all of my work, it's gone. Uh, you mean the scroll I brought back to you? I, you, I just literally gave it to you. No, Gwynny, and I still have that. I was just about to compare your findings with previous obs observations and tests, but I seem to have lost them while fleeing. While fleeing? Yes, we had originally set camp on the southern side of the Combine uh, Spires, close to Steamfront, but then a pack of kobolds moved in. They caught us off guard. I must have dropped my notes up there while fighting them off and running away. Hmm. I can go gather them for you. He's very confident of himself all the time, isn't he? Okay. That is what we're doing. I think we're up... Yeah, we're up there somewhere. So... This way, that way, glowy tray. Oh yes, yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't know where if, it, if it's, um, they've. Lo I mean, I'm, surely they haven't lost the files because it's not like anything ever really gets removed i wouldn't have thought um it could just be um issues in the database which means that the the uh, the, the voices are not properly linked with the thing to say yeah misplaced yeah probably probably uh there's a note ah there's a kobold Oh. And a shiny. Oh. No, already got that. Uh, I can see another note flickering over there. Mm -hmm. oh. I have no idea what your god guys are saying. Oh. Over this note while they think about dying. No? Oh. So you interrupt me picking up the note and then you die anyway. That's rude. Uh, another one, number two actually. One here and then there's one on the other side. So if I pull you guys in as well. Come on everyone, gather around. And then it's just you. Flask of rancid water. There's one more note. And there's another note. I can see another one just over there. We'll be done here in no time. There we go. I just uh, weave our way out. Nope, he didn't see me. 
can't catch me. I'm the I'm the uh, Gwenian man. Here we go. Hi, I'm back. Let me come down to your level again. It's only fair. You found my lost notes. That is such a relief. I was afraid I would be required to start my investigation all over again. Yeah, me too. Ah, this is intriguing. I had not thought of it before, but one of my previous investigations involved the rotting guardians patrolling Emerald Lake and Sapphire Pond. There is a chance the two are related. Oh, what do you mean? The magic used to ensource all the stones is old and crumbling, much like the guardians themselves. When they collapse, their magic could seep into water and be carried down to the river here. Ah, affecting the fallen buried, buried here. That's what I'm thinking, yes, but to be certain, I will need some new samples of the rotting guardian stones. Okay, I'll get them for you. And where are those? Over there. Okay, so I don't think that's helping with this area. I think we're just going to have to go in there and uh, and see what there is. We'll go back to finding Glade Shrublings. And, try, and desperately trying not to want to kill uh, Faith. Flies. I mean, they've invited me in, and I I'll just wait until somebody gets annoyed and, annoyed and attacks me, and then it's self defense. Not two of them together here. Oh, but that's all I needed. Uh right. So let's go and find our way back to the Queen. If I remember rightly, we go up this bit. <coughs> and across here. And there we go. I'm back. I'm down here. No, no. Have you collected the shrublings? Uh, yes, here you go. These will do nicely. Hmm, I can already see something's not right. This greenish powder shouldn't be here. Uh, what is it? I do not know. It reeks of high cap, though. Uh, high cap? Direct your gaze to the northeast. There upon the trunk of that tree, you can see a mushroom platform. It is referred to by some as high cap. Whatever this powder is, it was at one point on that high cap. The smell gives it away. Okay, what should we do? I'd like you to climb up there and investigate. All right. Bring whatever you find back to me. I will happily keep doing your quest for as long as you keep talking. So, uh, over there, apparently. Uh, so directly, yeah, directly opposite us here. Up there, is that where we're going? I think it is. Uh, looks like there's a climbing <coughs> wall over there. Yep, <coughs> there is. Ooh. Oh, this is interesting. Uh, this doesn't look like the sort of equipment the fairies would use. This is a makeshift alchemical lab. Uh, Xylene's theory is correct. Let's check the clues. Among the jars, there is a folded sheet of paper marked with the sigil of the Crushbone Orcs. Oh, we better report back. 
The orcs are up to no good. Again. And... Dash across. Uh, is this the bit that we... No, this is, isn't the bit that we're climbing. But hey, it is the day. Oh, I found a shortcut. Maybe. Or maybe that is... Oh, I, I don't know. Tortoise looks green and tree. Uh, we are on. Let me have a look. This might be 499 again. Uh, oh, no. 497. Okay. Hi there. Did you find anything? I found this crushed bone missive. Orcs. Why must they meddle? Hmm. This missive is old. This was before Mentha's work in this area. These orcs may not even be around to be punished, and yet they still corrupt us. But we mustn't let that consume our thoughts. No, we must focus on writing this. What can I do? Near the entrance to this glade, to our north, there are two protective warden spirits. They reside within the flowers just outside the glade. We will need their help. I would like you to go coax one of those wardens from his flower. You can then visit the glade shrublings and use that warden to cure them. Okay. I think I can do that. I only wish we had caught this sooner. I will act fast. Okay, draw forth a curative warden from one of the flower lamps just outside of Tunar's glade. Okay. Yep, definitely bad orcs. It's always bad orcs. Ah. You receive Curative Warden. Has that gone into a, a bag somewhere? Or is it just a... Uh... Okay. Release the Curative Warden near the Glade Shrublings to cleanse them. Right. Uh, glade Shrublings. These shrublings? Oh yeah, I see. Right. Got it. So this time we're not uh, gathering the bushes, we're now uh, cleaning them instead. Oh. You picked a fight with me. Fabric patch. The patchwork tapestry. Woo -woo. So, I need to type that one in manually. Patchwork tapestry. Are you, are you all going to come and have a go at me now? Calm down. Which I believe is that now. No, that's 499. <laughs> so close, so close. Oh. oh, I don't care. I don't care. You get up. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I'm getting. So it's all blurry then. Ah, he's given up and gone. Okay. Let's find a way back to uh, Xylene. We pull back in. Somewhere over. Oh, there's a climbing thing here. <coughs> or is this too far over there? Ah, uh, well, I guess we'll find out, won't we? Uh, let's see. Uh, nope, this isn't the bit that I wanted. This is a different bit. Okay. Not quite sure why there's a 
climbing thing up to there, but that's not the bit that we want. Oh. Getting lost. Oh, I got turned around, that's why. Okay, back, back, this way. Over here. There we go, there we go, it's over here. Uh, we kind of want to go up one of these. Was it this one? Well, it is now, anyway. <laughs> I think I found a different way up here every time. Are we ready for 500 quests according to the quest completion tab? Have you cured the saplings? I have. That's funny. Thank you. This is much appreciated. I'm glad you arrived when you did. This news will be of interest to Mentha, I am certain. You should tell her. I, I will let her know. And we go back to uh, Lexa Una. Good. Okay. Thank you again for your help. Uh, you are most welcome. Polite lady with a voice. Hmm? Right. Okay, let's go back and report. Yeah, we have done all the 500s. We have done 500 quests according to our own counter. We have done 500 quests according to the achievement system. And we have done 500 quests according to the completed quest journal. So we have done all the five. We have definitively done 500 quests. This will be 501. You return, Gwynion. I knew you were the correct one to answer Princess uh, Xylene's summons. Yep, I helped Xylene clean up what the orcs had left behind. Uh, from the last time we had cleared their orc from the glade, that is good news. I had hoped they were not, they were not threatening the grove once more. Thank you for this news. You're welcome. Right. Uh, I think now that just leaves us with magical runoff that sends us that way and uh, finding the scouts who I think are actually in this area. So uh, I am. Ooh. Right. So we will leave it here for the moment. Thank you for watching.